Congratulations on getting Fusion version 15. We hope the software will bring you everything you wish from the latest design software for kitchens, bedrooms and bathroom industry. Fusion version 15 also hosts some great new features which has allowed us to branch out into the interior decorating industry. Welcome to all. To install version 15 of Fusion, follow these steps and enjoy. If you need any assistance, please call us and we would be happy to help you over the phone or even online where we will install the program for you. For now, just install the CD. When the pop-up pops up, just click on the runinstaller.exe and it will take you through the installation. The new welcome page will, will pop up and ask you which installation you wish. The first one is the upgrade feature where if you have version 14, which I do, as you can see on my desktop, Fusion, Planet Fusion version 14, I would need to upgrade this. But if you do not have any previous version of Planet, or if you have version 12 and below, all you need to do is click on first time inst installation and it will take you through it. Let me show you what will happen if you click on the first time installation and go next. It will show you the the features that will be installed. So the first one that will be installed is the version 15 itself, the scripts that we, you would need to, to run the program, the version 15 tutorial, the catalogs, and also the database. Now this is where the, the problem comes in. If you had to do this and you had a database in version from version 14, it would overwrite it and you would lose some data. And also Maxima Live Update will be installed. But for now, because I've got version 14, all I want to do is update it. So I'm going to click Previous and go to, to Upgrade. And here I will show you exactly how to, to upgrade it. Now the steps are exactly the same as, as how you would do for the first time installation and the upgrade. So here goes. Let's go Next. You'll notice that the ones that are ticked are the version 15 of Fusion, the scripts for version 15 to make it operate, and also the, the version 15 tutorial. Those of you who've had Fusion version 14 will already have live update. But if you do not, you can tick it on and put it on. You don't need to put on version 15 catalogs as this will overwrite your, your database and you'll get rid of your existing designs. So all we're going to do now is just put on these three at the top here, which is the v Fusion version 15, Fusion version 15 additional features, which are the scripts, and the Fusion version 15 tutorial. Let's click on Next. Okay. So what we're going to load are these three features here. All you have to do is click on Install, and it will start running. Okay, Fusion is starting to install. It's putting on the Install Shield, which will guide you through this, this installation. The version 15 of Fusion might ask you to install some features or some drivers that it needs to put onto your PC before it can run the, f the latest version of Fusion. If it does that, just install those and then move on to, to this phase, which is the installation of, of Fusion. Now, for instance, if you have an, a Planet Fusion version 14 installed on your PC, it will say that that setup has detected a version of Fusion and that you would need to go next. If not, it will say that welcome to Fusion and do you, if you want to install, click Next. So they're both very similar, but for now I'm just going to click Next and we can continue on with the installation. Okay, now it's going to install the latest version and also back up some of your databases and also back up your your catalogs. One thing you'll notice while it's backing up your, your database and catalogs is that it will take away your Planet Fusion Live icon off your desktop. This is okay because it's going to be putting on a brand new Fusion icon onto your desktop. Okay. Once Fusion has backed up your database, it will start the installation uh, process. And here we can see that it will automatically install the stuff for you. So it's removing the backup files and installing at the moment. So you don't have to do anything 
while you when you're upgrading. Fusion is is now upgrading my database and putting in in the features that I, I need to to run it. And this will take a, a few minutes, but not too long. Make sure that you have your your dongle connected into your 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 PC so that it does give in, doesn't give you this area where it says no dongle, so unable to start application. You'll need to stick your dongle in for for this program to to work. Let's click on that. We can continue with the installation so that it will install the, the scripts and and all the rest of the the features that we need. Okay, I'm going to click on finished when I've finished installing my my program. And from there it's going to install the the scripts. As you can see the the screen is is doing it at the moment. It's installing the scripts and from then it will install the the version 15 tutorial which is different from the the previous tutorial that that we have sent out. So we would recommend that you do that you do go and watch it and learn some of the the great new features that that 15 has has for you the installation is now installing the version 15 tutorial and here we go the installation has finished you'll notice that you've got a new fusion icon and a fusion version 15 tutorial icon now it will say here an important before opening a design in version 15 of Fusion, you will need to install the version 15 catalogs through Tools Catalog Setup. These catalogs are located on the installation DVD under the directory Catalogs. Now this is important, otherwise when you open up a, a new design or an existing design, it will need to convert and update your existing catalogs and it does take a long time. It, if you've got half a day to spend, then you're more than welcome to do that. But I would recommend this step because it takes a lot quicker to do. You'll notice when you click on OK and it and you click on finish when you finish the installation it will add a new desktop icon. Here is the new icon. It's the Fusion blog item icon. If you double click on it it will take you to the blog which has many videos and pictures and little blog posts that will help you to to learn more about fusion and also little tips and tricks that will get you started so let's go into fusion and install those catalogs that we that we need to do now okay i'm going to double click on the fusion icon when the connect login screen pops up you can put in the, the password which is automatically and defaulted to admin. I'm just going to type in admin and press OK. And now it's going to go into the program. First thing it, it will do, it will start synchronizing your, your catalogs. This will take a, a few seconds or a few minutes depending on your, your PC. Here is the Fusion version 15. Now I've got no customers because I didn't have any customers from version 14. But if you did, they would all still be here. Now before you open up any customer, click on Cancel, click on Tools, click on Catalog Setup, and click on Install Catalogs. From here, go to your, your DVD drive so that you can install the, the catalogs. So you'll notice that it's in your DVD drive under catalogs and you highlight those catalogs that you're wanting to up, update which is all of them unless you've got your own specific one that you've made changes to and that's the only one that you wouldn't but otherwise you would click open and that would install the, the catalogs for you and update them so that you can use the new fusion version 15 thank you very much